هون عندنا مشكلة هي الأساسية هي مشكلة المياه كانت المياه عام 25 متر و30 متر حفر الأبار أو ثلاث سنين الماضيين تم الجفاف نزلنا لحدود ال 450 متر اللي هو عندنا عندنا كروم عنب انتزعت لأنه السنتين الماضيين ما قدرنا رويناها So the whole Middle East region, in general, it's a dry region. More than 85% of the water used on the planet, on land, is used by agriculture. And many people don't know that. The problem is that most farmers do not know what the actual irrigation requirement is. Most farmers in our region, they have smartphones. They're familiar with this type of technology. So I thought about what if we can bring it, you know, to the farmer's phone with a smart app in which the farmer can just pinpoint his field and then a number will come up telling him how much he needs to irrigate. I'm an agricultural engineer and I'm an irrigation engineer and also a remote sensing specialist. So, uh, so this is what I like to do and this is what I can do best. Our project has to do with predicting uh, water use metrics for use by farmers. Our machine learning model took as predictors the weather conditions such as wind speed, relative humidity, air temperature, land surface temperature and DVI metrics and learned the highly complex associations between these predictive variables. We've managed to use the Google Cloud Platform technologies for high volume scraping of weather variables. We've used shallow models as well as deep learning models to try and explore the complex interactions between these variables and the evapotranspiration metric. With the help of you know, this accelerator program with Google, we were introduced to all of this spectrum of cutting-edge technology advances in, in how to bring a solution to the people's level. <laughs> إذا نعطى إرشادات للمزرعين إنه أنت لازم تسقي هان هالقد كمية بالعكس نحن بنتشجع لأنه أول شغلة نكون عم نوفر على حالنا مصاري عم نوفر على حالنا أسمدة وعم نوفر على حالنا إشياء كتير وتاني شغلة عم يعلى مستوى الإنتاج. We don't want to see any farmer who has a big uncertainty in applying water to his land. So we want to improve the existing knowledge of the farmers with the use of these scientific products so that the farmers would be managing their water more efficiently than they do now.